Hello Rutbags, it's Jade. Welcome to Vinlands. This is the area that you'll get by completing some of the quests for the hidden ones. Basically the first few stages, you'll go and to London, you'll take out some targets for the hidden ones once you've got the Assassin's Bureau unlocked in your settlement, and then he'll give you the option to go to Vinlands to do some revenge. So, I'm not gonna spoil that too much, although I already have done a guide for Vinlands. Today is, of course, the legendary creatures. A North American moose, yes, a massive one, and this isn't actually listed as part of the hunter's missions, so I don't think you necessarily need it to get the reward. You do get a reward for killing all of the legendary creatures, but I do believe you don't have to do this one, so this is like an additional option. I've already shown the location on the map at the early start of this video, so it's just bang centre in the middle of the North American Vinland's area. Oyan Donaire, I'm so sorry if I said that completely wrong. He's a giant moose, he's pretty ferocious, but he shouldn't be too challenging. Bearing in mind that when you get to Vinland's, you won't have any of your equipment or your armor sets that you normally do, you have to basically start over again. So you are going to need some sort of weapon, I highly suggest you do the story content first before taking this guy out, and then you'll be able to buy some weapons from one of the traders. I've literally got just the spear and just some basic armor sets. I don't even think I've got a full armor set. It's just the clothes that you get given when you arrive. So yeah, it's going to be a bit of a challenge if you've got this maybe on the harder difficulties. You can see I've equipped a poison though. You do keep to get all your abilities and all your skills as well. And I've also got all my adrenaline shots. That's pretty key for taking this guy out. You can see my damage there with the spear. I'm doing anywhere between 15 and maybe 50 occasionally if I get the right spot behind him. I think the weak spots in this guy are pretty tough. Like his legs are pretty small. So yeah, if you're a better shot than me, you'll be able to take him out even easier just lining up. It's pretty deadly that one, especially because it just makes the screen go all muddy and dirty and it's hard to see. So definitely got to look out for that one and it doesn't give you as much options to let you know it's actually happening. So you've got to kind of roll forward is my suggestion. Get behind it at all times. It will do a kick like that, but again, it's just something that you can maybe sidestep and then use your diving Valkyrie to get around it. So you can see I'm really utilizing that slow motion skill that I've unlocked which you can find in the I think the raven skill tree but for sure this is more of a challenge I guess because you haven't got all your normal armor weapons here I'm trying to use a few different abilities see if they work I find that using the throwing axe on some of these guys is just pointless like it only really works for more static enemies anything that can move around a bit quicker I find they'll dodge them quite a bit you can see my adrenaline's gone down now so I'm gonna have to just try and get hold of him quickly it doesn't really do any other sort of special moves he may do it a little bit more where he turfs up the ground to try and make it a bit cloudy but he doesn't get any super strength or anything like that it's a pretty basic fight sadly unlike all the other creatures you are not going to be able to demonstrate you've killed this guy like you can't have a stat you i mean you might have something that you get from killing him i can't remember if you do i finally done a finishing move on him as he's close to death but yeah some of the other creatures you're meant to be able to show the stuff off at your longhouse, although it's still glitch for me, I still can't see it. I've completed every one of them by the time I'm recording and doing the editing voiceover for this. But you do get two skill points out of killing him, so that makes it just about worth it. That is it. Short, sweet and simple today. I'll be back to take on the polar bear if you haven't already seen it and showing you all the creatures in one video, just in case you want to see that instead. Until next time, Ratbags, I will catch you lot later.